we're going to start in heaven. We're going to let you know how it all began when it comes to the nature of the most high, which is 100 percent masculine. He created something out of itself, out of himself in the beginning, the Holy Spirit. That would be the feminine opposite of his nature. He created the Holy Spirit, which is a feminine mirror of his nature and his kindness. Which tells us what? There's no such thing as a man, a real man. In his cause and purpose. Endowed in him through the most high. It's impossible for a man, a masculine. To have a feminine side. Impossibility. It's impossible for a woman who was born female. To have a masculine side. But when Satan brings forth and produce what? You got it. Produce content in media that urges us and incentivize us to go against our nature. That's when the sickness began. We don't realize the majority of the mental illnesses in this earth is us fighting against our natural innate nature. the peer pressure to have us go against our nature. And at the end of the day, the other people may, may, may view and, and see your life and think it's happy, think it's success. When you know when you're to yourself, you're miserable. You're miserable, even though to the world, everything looks, looks good. You know why? No one is really content unless they're in their natural nature and their purpose God gave them from the beginning. A woman is only happy when she's nurturing, helping, loving. It's the struggles of this world that have taken her out of her nature. And we're seeing this end product blaming her, not real when she was told wrong. She was she was directed the wrong way. And at one time in the old times, guess what? The fathers and those that were around them protected them from their youth. It was the men who protected young women from their decisions early because early women are silly women and they grow into wisdom later. Okay. <laughs> but when women get wise and they get to the age, they look back and say, hold up. Someone told me the wrong stuff. My father was responsible for, for protecting me in my what? My most impressionable and attractive years. And now she's out there fending like a man, doing things of a man. And then what happens? She has to become her own protector. She has to do things outside of her nature. Then what happens? The stress does to her what it used to do to men. Her hair start falling out. Her hair falls out. She's up all night looking at the bills, stressed on what's going on. And next thing you know, what? That's right. That's right. Early mortality. They start dying younger when women used to outlive men. Hey, this is what Satan wanted, folks. So I don't want to put too much out there, but we're going to go into the modern day Adam, Eve, and the serpent. There's no such thing as a man tapping into his femininity. A man, a male is 100% masculine. There's no such thing as a man having emotional intelligence. A man is a man. That's what makes him a hunter, a producer. Okay. So, the, so yeah, there have been a role, a reversal of roles, but the most high uh, has, is working to set it straight for those who want peace. Right. So we're going to talk about that and more.